right, all right. We are at it again. We are at a new RV park called Mill Creek in Elkmont, Alabama. What do you think about it so far? <laughs> he just drank a little water. It's going down the wrong way. We've got the leprechaun set up. It's a beautiful place. I'm gonna show you around a little bit. It's kind of simple. We're on gravel for the first time. It's gonna be neat. And look what just pulled in. You got all types. You've got a big old buses. And then you got people you can definitely tell that are living here full time. All right, we'll show you around Mill Creek. What do you think? Good. <laughs> already be in love with this place they'll do anything for their customers look at them cutting down limbs to get that in there Ooh -wee. <laughs> you've got three rows to park all your rvs over there and then you've got all this area back here to play in walk your dog throw your frisbee whatever you want to do it's pretty cool and then on the, there's some woods over there they have a path into a creek i'm gonna show you that next it's pretty cool Ah, Sergi, what you got there, JT? What you got? Ooh. A windmill. Yes, it is. American flag windmill. I like that. The woods got a little opening right there. JT's mm -hmm. going through. It's beautiful. Beautiful little spot. Yeah. So they have. They don't really have trails here, but they have all these openings that they've made that they've cut into the woods, and they kind of keep it cut down. And man, it is cool in here. It just dropped. 10 degrees nice cool see all this open area walk through back of the, behind this one here I can actually hear a little bit of water running right now a little creek down there JT has found the main bit of it we'll come right over here and you are in this is Mill Creek. I guess that's what this is. Come right down here. Mill Creek. Boom. Pretty little creek. Nice, cool little spot. Let's have a little fun, JT. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. All right. We'll go up and down the creek a little bit. Have a little bit of fun. Maybe we won't see any snakes or any, any no so show deers. little adventure up the creek there's some slick rocks here trying to fall mama Ooh. whoa <laughs> well, that's where stuff is It's around the corner. I just keep going and going and going. This creek is super shallow. It's cool water though.
what you think, Mama. There you go, Mill Creek has to offer. <laughs> I saw one cool thing right when you come out of this little creek. Look at this tree, JT. Look straight up this tree. Isn't that cool? Look at that vine has taken over that tree. All right, let's get out of here and go see what else has in Mill Creek RV Park. There's our humble little spot next to this huge class a yeah here we go here we go <laughs> sorry dog tired are you dog tired i think you are dog tired are you here at mill creek if you want to get to the trail real quickly here's the dumpster you come in here's the dumpster there's a little passageway right here you go before Sarge comes. it takes you to the rails to trails it's 10 miles of trails you got about a mile left that way to the left and then to the night to the right you got nine miles that way and it's perfectly straight it's amazing there's about a hundred geocaches on it <laughs> All right, see you at a geocache. I think we're gonna find one. That's the plan, anyways. This one is slippery. Uh, let me get up here and help you then. There's a rock there. <laughs> All right, big boy. Oh, got it right there. Can see I it? see it? Yeah, we can see it. Uh, you can pop that one open while we're looking at it. Yeah, good list of names. Cool deal. All right, so geocaches. There's a hundred of them on this trail. If you like geocaching, this is where you got to be. I have one more geocache before this sun goes down. I got to say, though, the temperature is amazing, huh, JT? Yeah. Doesn't it feel good out here, Beth? Yeah. feels so good. Look at this black choo-choo train. It looks like it's on the left side of this choo-choo train. We're going to check it out. We will let you know when we find it. That's when we found a dove. There's a dove under here, JT. <coughs> Don't scare it. Look at that. Hey, dove. <laughs> oh, we're going to leave him alone. I bet this is where he sleeps. And we'll come find this cache in the morning after they get up and they go flying away. So the dove came to roost right here. I don't see it anywhere though. I, I There's a nest. Look, it's baby birds. We found baby birds. Whoa. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Whoa. I really want to see the baby birds. We didn't find the cache, but we found some birds. Don't you touch them. There's about five or six of them in there. See the nest? Yep. They're probably little baby doves. Beautiful. All right, let's leave him alone. <laughs> Y'all have a good night. <laughs> that was fun. A little action. Name it for. We hit, hit the hiss, the sack. Found these beautiful horses. Look at those, that paint horse and that palomino. Those are beautiful horses. Is that not a palomino, that brown one? Now, horses can bite you, buddy. Be careful. Say, hey, beautiful horse. Hi. How are y'all? Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Hit him in the nose. Aren't y'all beautiful horses? Yeah, that dog might make him nervous, so be careful. Yeah. So here's your local horses at the Mill Creek. Yeah, be careful now. Be careful with the dog. 
All right. And so we got up early this morning and JT had a vacation Bible school. Was vacation Bible school great? Yes. <laughs> so now we're back at the uh, Mill Creek RV Park and we just had to come back down to this creek because it's so cool. So we're going to just venture around this creek just for a little while and um, then we'll see y'all in a little bit. All right. Our next piece of wildlife over here got a huge box turtle. Let's go down here and check him out. Get a little closer. Can you see him? Can you see him? There he is. Hey, buddy. Looks like his eyes are shut, like he's sleeping. Oh, he was sleeping. He just opened them up. Let's see what he does. You see him, buddy? A box turtle. Yeah, what do you think about that? Cool. He was sitting there sleeping. He had his eyes shut. You want to pet him? Hey, buddy. Yes. You want to touch his head? Go for it. Whenever I pet turtles, I pet their shell. Hey, buddy. What you doing? You're not scared at all, are you? You're not scared at all. All right, let's off to the next adventure. Let's go, JT. Let's find something else. Bamboo, maybe a panda came down here and cut it down. <laughs> maybe we'll have to keep our eyes open for a black and white panda. What do you think? Awesome! Right, I'm going to catch going. you. Whoa. Remnants of a beaver. Beaver cut this down and is just laying here in the water. It's actually a really great walking stick. I might keep it. That's good. <laughs> oh, little barrel right there too. And this is a clean, pretty creek. Man, it's beautiful. All types of little sluices and little cold spots. You like this place, JT? Yes. All right. And the uh, mix together. <laughs> Did you decide to go swimming? That was not water. <laughs> Did you get down in there and go swimming? How'd it feel? You did though. <laughs> Was it cold? <laughs> I bet it felt good though. <laughs> do it. Don't do it, JT. Don't jump off a waterfall. Ah! <laughs> good job. <laughs> JT, I see a, I see a snake. Ah, I see a snake. Run! Look here. It's a snake, JT. Run. It's a woody. A woody snake. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, we are on our camping trip here, and uh, we are about to discover 100 geocaches. So we got four more to go. We'll let you see all them. JT, there's one over there somewhere. Let's see if you can go find it. Four more, and we get to 100. That'll be a great milestone for us. Anyways, hope you enjoy the adventure. So this one says it's on the east side of Trail base of 30 inch diameter tree all right here we go Let's see if we can find it under those rocks what's under those rocks Move them. Ha, ha, ha. there it is one of those two cool cover back up we found it three to go so on this rails to trails richard martin trail we have some covered bridges. They're so pretty. Look at the creek below. This is pretty awesome. Oh, yeah. That's probably the creek we were walking through earlier. That's probably Mill Creek. Ooh, JT, we got to go down there. Go a little bit of swimming. I see bass and everything down there. Oh, yeah. Climb up there. Look through it. Let's look at this side, too. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Oh, it's deeper over here. 
That's pretty cool. Let me have to check it out. Very good. Get up there and check it out, big boy. What do you think? Awesome. Yeah. All right, all right. So right past the covered bridge, you take a right-hand turn, and you've got a trail. Looks like it leads down below the bridge. Yes, it does. Woohoo! This is going to be nice. Yeah, be careful there. Yeah, he's slipping, slipping. <laughs> Whoa, he ran it out. Cool. Look at this. People have made little dams to create these little waters. This is a cool place, JT. I'm going to finish that dam. This is pretty awesome. Hey, Oh, look at that. Somebody left you a sun drop, Beth. This would be a good hole right here. You could jump in that. It's deep enough. What? This is cool. This is the best swimming hole around right here. Shaded swimming hole under the covered bridge. Y'all wave at me. This is beautiful. Yeah. All right. Awesome. Want to jump in? <laughs> and, and jump in. Go! <laughs> um, Mama's here. She probably won't let you. <laughs> but this would be a good spot. Right there. You're gonna go. In the world, it's a bullfrog tadpole. Let's see if we can get it on video. Buddy, so this bullfrog tadpole. Guess what's down here, JT? Bullfrog. Bullfrog. So maybe we can catch the bullfrog. What do you think about that? Awesome. Let JT jump in from right there. You ready, JT? Yes. Three, two, one, go! Jump out! Good job. How's it feel? That is a grab. Log it. Side hanging bison tube on sapling behind seven inch diameter tree. Seven inch, there it is. Look behind, look right straight back there, big boy. It's shiny. I see it. Let's get a video of it real fast. 
Boom. Touch it. That's number 99. Let's go get one more, and that will make a 100. Let's do it. So right here, edit, and it's supposed to be under a railroad tie. So it's under a piece of wood that's probably square or round. It's over here. Can you see it? Start looking for it. Where's the railroad thing? Where's the railroad thing? I don't know. Somewhere over here. Gotta keep looking. Look down there. Let's see if we can find it. You wanna go first or me? I want you to go first and then I'll follow how you Here we go. I'm down here. All right, says it's under one of these ends of this railroad tie. See this poison ivy down here? Ah, that got me. That's okay. Look at that rock. Well, what do you think is under that rock? I think we're found to find number 100. Let's see. 100 JT number 100. Yes, that is awesome. What are you thinking about finding 100? Awesome. Yes. All right, let's go back to camp, get some food in our bellies, and we'll see you on the next adventure. That's so we're back at the leprechaun. Let's go and see what mama's got going on. This may be our last little meal. Have maybe a sunset. That'll be that. Woo, smells good in here, mama. <laughs> it smells like onions. <laughs> Look what mama just did. Sausage, rice, sweet taters, spinach. Mama, you're amazing. We love you. We love mama, don't we? Let's chow down on this food. Hey, y'all have a good night. Do a little time lapse. As the sun goes down, we'll see you on the next adventure. I'm about to eat that sausage right there. Yes, I am. I know, we came out of those woods and it got bright, didn't it? Yeah. Somebody turned the bright lights on. Look at that big dog. Hey, big dog. How are you? Oh, I didn't see you sitting there. <laughs> you come out of the woods and it's bright light. 